Hi, my name is Joe Alter, and I'm going to be showing you Shave and a Haircut 4.5, working with Maya 8.5 and Pixar's RenderMan Studio 1.0. How easy is it? Well, let's create some hair and hit Render. All the pipeline is taken care of for you. From the moment that you install, you're ready to go. You're ready to hit Render and get Shave Hair. We provide our own shaders. They get installed with our installers, along with source that you can go ahead and edit. Uh, every production has some picky little thing they want to do with the light model, like how it's mixed together at the end. You can insert your own scripts where we insert ours in the injection points. You can toggle on and off various render man parameters depending on how you want to optimize and what you want to optimize for. You can set voxels for massive hair renders where you want to do middles, millions of hairs. Uh, you can replace our shader with your own shader. Uh, if you don't like ours, my feelings won't be hurt. Not much. <laughs> uh, all this is designed so that you can be wheels to ground from the moment that you get the product. Uh, just run the installers and you can actually start creating things, which is, which is exactly what F Fuel VFX of New Zealand has done when they created this spot. Uh, featuring these two characters, a stuffed animal, and a microphone. Uh, completely unbeknownst to us during the beta. We've heard you're fed up with big bills. Have you seen the size of this phone, man? We've heard you want unlimited calls. Oh, yeah, I know. And really fast broadband. Oh, come on. That's why Optus has created Australia's first home phone and broadband cap with unlimited local, national and calls to Optus mobiles, plus fast broadband for just $69 a month to customers on the Optus network. Yes, we hear you. Okay, now to show you something more complicated than a hairball, we're going to do this dog. We've grown some hair on it. It's all uniform. I'm going to show you how to comb it. I'm going to shrink it down here. And we'll do some local editing of size as well using our brush just to show you that while Pixar has done a beautiful job of making RenderMan easy to use and accessible with RMS uh, we've done similar with hair you don't need Maya Unlimited either to run this it's it's uh, all the hair is done by our software and all the dynamics and collisions and all that. You can actually do a lot more than what we're showing here. Uh, I would encourage you to download the demo, look at the docs, look at some of our tutorials, and actually try it on our website. It will work with RMS or without RMS. Here we're puffing it out. That's looking pretty good. Now we're going to do a render. And it's that easy. Anyway, I want to thank Pixar for letting me show this stuff at their booth, and I want to thank them for being so kind and patient during their beta period and our beta period. Uh, and I also want to thank Video Tutors for doing their uh, tutorial CDs about shaving a haircut and their live demos at the booth. Uh, I'm sorry I couldn't be at SIGGRAPH. I wish I was, but I couldn't be. Um, and if you have any ideas or thoughts, just drop me an email. Uh, there's the website. And uh, hope to talk to you soon.